Hi guys, it's me, Sharon, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, hello and welcome. And if you're returning, thank you and welcome back. I'm super excited that you decided to share some of your time with me today. And I'm also super excited because it's finally here. It is the Spring Coffee Table Decor Challenge 2020. And this challenge is being hosted by me, Sharon of Creative Glam. And my co-host is Cheryl, Cheryl of I Style My Style. I have left a link down below in the description box to Cheryl's channel. If you haven't already, stop by and check her out. I am sure you will find lots of videos that you'll enjoy. I want to thank all the participants that participated in the Spring Coffee Table Decor Challenge 2020. Thank you. And I want to thank all of you that are watching. I appreciate your support. Here in YouTube land, we tend to start the seasonal decor a little early in order to provide inspiration for those of them that are looking for ideas for that season's decor in their home. So I created two looks and they're both pretty neutral. One is gold and one is silver. I kept it that way intentionally. This way you can get your inspiration and therefore add your own accent pieces for the seasons. I can't wait to see what you all came up with and I'm looking forward to seeing the playlist. But right now, let me show you what I did. This is look number one. It is gold themed. I got this beautiful gold tray last year from Home Goods. I don't always have a plan when it comes to my coffee table slash ottoman decor, but usually I build from a tray. Usually it's seasonally related. So therefore I do have a color theme in mind because I've probably already done a centerpiece somewhere in the kitchen or uh, on the table somewhere there is something that I'm picking up my color theme from. So I may not always have a plan as to how I'm going to work it, but I usually have a color theme in mind. So we're gonna build from here. Uh, I got this beautiful candle holder from Big Lots. As a matter of fact, I got two of them, because you know me, I always buy in twos. Um, and I thought it would go perfect with my gold theme spring coffee table decor. And then I got my coffee table books, uh, Elements of Style, Paris and Bloom, and Beautifully Organized. Of course, we all know who that's by, Nikki Boyd, here on YouTube. And I thought I'd add some geometric shape to the process. that beautiful gold bowl from Home Sense.
Okay, for look number two, as I said earlier, it's gonna have a silver theme. I'm gonna start with what I'm using for a tray is a wall mirror that I made. I will link the video to the creation of this wall mirror up above in the cards. I don't remember where I got that tray from. I think I got it from Target. And in this decorative box, I got that from HomeSense. Again, all of this stuff I already owned, and if I didn't say that earlier, all of the items that I'm using today, I already own, so I'm just shopping my home. I created, I created in my basement, I had an area that I could use for home decor storage, seasonal home decor storage. So when I say I shop my home, I literally shopped my home. I felt like I was in my store, it was a lot of fun. So again, everything here I already owned. I pulled them out and moved them around from different rooms as well as from my home decor storage to create these looks today. And I will also link that up above the creation of my home decor storage. got that from home goods the uh, the silver mirror towel vase with the white flowers in it I got that from Ross the flowers that are in it came from Michaels my Joe Malone candle and you saw that in a video where I did a haul for my Joe Malone products I'll link that video as well and this is a vase that I picked up from I got that, that vase from J.C. Penney's a long time ago. The gather sign came from Home Goods. And then I'm just going to use my statue um, that I got in Paris. I thought it would go well with this book that I also got in Paris. Thanks for tuning in to the spring coffee table decor challenge. I hope you enjoyed this challenge. I sure did. And to all of you that participated, thank you. And I hope you had fun as well. And if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button below along with the notification bell. Hit it twice so that you don't miss out on any of my future videos. And don't forget to leave me a comment and I'd appreciate it if you gave me a thumbs up. And now that you've made it to this point in my video, 
follow the link down below in the description box to see the other content creators and their videos and their contribution to this challenge. Again, thanks for participating. Thanks for watching. Have a blessed day and I'll see you right back here next time on Creative Glam. Bye.